Hey guys, welcome back to another one. Today, we are going to continue with the maglev train. Okay, let's get right into it. Yeah, you might be wondering why um, it's all gray. Uh, oh, oh. Ta-da! I made a, uh, track. I made a track for my, um, maglev car. Magnet car, you know? Um... I had to modify it because this is smaller than what I had. Also, I made this map custom. Um, also, look how huge these terminals are. Like, my dude could never use these. I'm good. I'm gonna make everything smaller except for the uh, except for this. I'll, I'll keep this the same height and everything. Um, but. Uh, let's stop blabbering and just get straight to it. Okay, cool. Here we go. Here it is. So I put, it does still hover, obviously. Look, it just barely hovers. But it does. Because for some reason, this is a very, um, like, the collisions are not good. As you can see, I am, like, booking this, and, like, it's terrible. Also, the turns are way too sharp. I need to, uh, not sharp. They're not gradual enough. I need to make them more gradual. So, yeah, that's just, the turns are really bad. Um... It works pretty good. So, I found on the, what's it called? Trail mapper? Trail? Yeah, trail mappers. Um, this block right here, it's a magnet block. And it comes free floating. So, it just um, spawned in. Like, I spawned it in, trying to test it out. And... They all fell to the ground. And I was like, ah, what happened? Um, so I didn't know that it was, it wasn't static. So I need to definitely, so these are like 10 degree intervals, I think, mostly. So I think I need to do like five intervals instead. Or maybe just make the blocks longer so that the 10 degrees you have longer to uh the vehicle excuse me has longer to get used to it oh my goodness i can't land on this here we go so yeah i think i just make everything longer but that's really annoying because i can't have anything else because you can't double select anything so i had to Basically, I had, I built the track first, and then everything else around it, which really stinks, because that means, to make this better, I have to, oh my goodness, I'm just gonna get in the view, I have to, um, It also wiggles. It likes to wiggle. I don't know why. Um, I put it on like 30 strength. It's still, those hinges still just try to bend. Oh, yep. See? Way too steep. I have to go like 2 miles an hour so I don't tip over, which is kind of annoying. Oh, don't look over there. project um project stuff not not my big project but uh, you know a project future project um okay so yeah um it's gonna take a minute to fix everything yeah I can't have it doing that and I have a gyro stabilizer in here like on max strength so they're under here 
obviously. Got, you know, one of those. Two of these in this direction. Honestly, I could probably go without the front to back stabilization. Maybe just one of them. And the magnets are on the inside. So what I realized, they're tractor beams, not magnets. They used to be magnets, but whatever. I call it magnets, because that's what they are. Okay, because this is metal. Well, I guess they do connect to wood in the other places. You can, like, attach yourself to, um, not, like, you can't attach yourself to anything, but certain objects in the game. And this is a magnet, uh, block, that's why, um, oh, y'all didn't see it. I was testing by myself. So I made a map, and I just used, like, like, you know, a concrete piece. It didn't work. What was I doing? Right. I was showing y'all, you know, the stuff. So it's got the, you know, one, two. I put the thrust on the uh, things that hinge instead of the body. Because the body, if it wasn't pulling it, technically it's still pushing because there's mass in front of it. So it needs to pull more than push. But I tried to make it as look as good as I could with what I was working with. I'm not very good at form. You'll probably already know that. Yeah, so I'm going to shrink those terminals down. I'm going to expand, make the curves shorter. Maybe make a map to go around this. Maybe. I don't have a lot of time. I'm really working on that big project uh, more than anything else. So I think that's all from me um, for today. Um, this week I'm going to have two videos out, so you should uh, go watch that one when it comes out. Uh, I think it will come out Wednesday. Yeah. So I'm going to put one out, you know, my typical Saturday, and then one Wednesday this week. So, yeah, I'll see you in that one uh, if you come watch that one. Please do. Uh, the first one, definitely go watch the first one if you haven't seen the first one. Um, it worked a lot better because this thing is... Maybe maybe if I shorten it and put a different block on the bottom. Maybe that's the whole problem. I, d I don't know. I don't know how to fix it. I'll try to fix it. I might update this, put it on the workshop. No idea. Steam workshop. Steam only, sorry. Yeah, I hope you, I hope this video has earned your subscription. This has been Groot. Comment down below what y'all want to see next. And I will see y'all in the next one. Goodbye.